Move over, Star Wars! Astronomers have discovered an exotic star system that puts you to shame. Did you know our solar system is a bit of a loner in the galaxy? Most stars actually have companions, and some even have multiple. For example, binary star systems are very common, consisting of two stars orbiting around a common center of mass. Usually, you can't see them with a naked eye. To an observer on Earth, they'll most likely mold together and appear to be one. For example, Alpha Centauri A and Alpha Centauri B together form a binary system. They're some of the brightest stars in their constellation and the third brightest in the night sky in general, outshined only by Sirius and Canopus. But if you look at them, they'll appear to be a single star. Although it's not always like this. There are also so-called double stars. They're located so close that they may seem like a binary system, and they can either be one or not. You can even do a little eye test. In the Big Dipper constellation, try to look for Mizar and Alcor. They're kind of hard to spot, but they're right there on the arm of the Big Dipper. Now, if you're able to see them not as one, but two, then you have good eyesight. And hey, why settle for just two stars when you can have more? Triple systems are also quite common, with three stars orbiting around each other in a delicate cosmic dance. These systems can be full of surprises, because the orbits are so difficult to predict. But all this pales in comparison with the recent discovery. A few years ago, a team of researchers discovered an actual five-star solar system. It's located 250 light-years away in the Ursa Major constellation and was discovered by the Super Wasp project. All of the stars there were formed from the same disk of dust and gas, and now they're connected in one complex gravitational dance. Now, this doesn't mean they're all incredibly close to each other. They don't do some kind of a square dance, you know. In fact, they're separated by more than the distance of Pluto's orbit around the Sun. Usually, such large systems consist of smaller ones. For example, in this case, there are two stars that are super far away. Two stars that are so close that one is practically stealing the other's hydrogen, you bad boy, and one tag-along lone companion. But they all orbit around a common center of gravity. With all these interactions, it's a wonder they don't collide and create one big bright mess in the sky. But it's not surprising that each such system is more complex and rarer than the previous one. And this all raises the question, what kind of unique environments could exist in such systems? What would our life look like if we lived there? Well, let's see. Picture this, you're on a planet orbiting one of the stars in a quintuple system. It's a sunny day, and you're ready to hit the beach. As you step out of your space house, you look up at the sky and see not one, not two, but five suns shining bright like diamonds. Two of them are super close together, almost as if they were one. Then you see the other pair, a bit further apart, each with their own glow. And finally, the loner star in the corner just doing its own thing. It's overwhelming, to say the least. Now, you might be wondering, but what would the day-night cycle and changing of seasons look like on such a planet? Well, here things might get a little complicated. Depending on the orbits of the stars, the planet could experience pretty random daylight and darkness hours. They can even be constant or last for very long periods of time. All depends on the location of the planet. If we lived in a binary star system, things would be easier. There would be two distinct periods of day and night as the planet orbits around the two stars. But with five stars, their brightness and position would be constantly changing. So the day-night cycle could get extremely chaotic. Hey, I need my sleep here! On the other hand, this would make for some pretty spectacular views. We could experience several different sunrises and sunsets, each of different brightness and color per day. The changing of seasons doesn't get easier. You know how on Earth we have four seasons caused by the tilt of our planet's axis in relation to the Sun? Well, in a five-star system, the locations of the stars could drive our planet insane. It's like having multiple chefs in the kitchen, all trying to cook different dishes at the same time. For example, if we're closer to star A, we experience more summer-like conditions. If we're closer to star B, things will be more chilly and wintry. And if we're located somewhere in the middle, we'll experience both summer and winter at the same time. 
It's like trying to juggle multiple balls at once. And this is a super simplified explanation. There are also things like the planet's orbital path, the tilt of its axis, the gravitational pull, yada yada. In short, the weather forecast will now become 10 times more unreliable. I'd hate to be the weather person on TV. That's a no-win scenario. And if that's not enough, then how about a roller coaster of radiation? The nasty solar winds and heat from multiple stars could make the conditions on our planet super harsh, rendering it uninhabitable. For example, if you're unlucky enough to live too close to the binary pair of stars, you'll feel like you're constantly stuck in a microwave. But hey, at least you wouldn't have to go to the tanning salon. And if you're too far away from the stars, it would be like living in an eternal winter wonderland. And if you're somewhere in the middle, well, imagine living in a place where you can get sunburn and frostbite on the same day. And this is just the beginning. You see, with five stars in the mix, there's a whole lot of gravity to go around. That's like being in a group hug with some really strong and clingy friends. The gravitational forces from the stars could tug and pull at the planet, creating tides so strong they could wash away entire cities. And don't even get me started on the earthquakes. With all that gravity, the ground beneath our feet would feel like it's constantly shaking, rattling, and rolling. On the bright side, though, <laughs> at least we'd always have an excuse for being late to work. Uh, sorry boss, I got caught in a gravity wave and ended up on the other side of the planet. Uh, you're not buying that, are you? As you can see, we'd have to try hard to adapt to such a system. All this, obviously, would create some challenges for agriculture. With multiple stars in the sky, plants would have to adapt to receiving light from different angles and intensities throughout the day. Farmers might need to create something to protect crops from excess heat and radiation. On the other hand, having multiple sources of energy from the stars is pretty awesome. Imagine fields of solar panels soaking up the rays from all five stars. But hey, maybe we would have been lucky and ended up on a planet where gravity and temperature changes wouldn't have bothered us so much. In that case, living in such a unique and inspiring environment doesn't sound too bad. It would have a great impact on our culture, arts, technology, and so on. With such a unique view of the cosmos, people would have a whole new canvas to work with. And just imagine, this isn't even the most complex of the systems we've discovered. For example, have you heard of A.R. Cassiopeia? It's a septuple star system, meaning it has seven stars orbiting around each other. Now you might be thinking, wow, that must be a real chaos. And you're not wrong. Imagine trying to navigate a spaceship through all those gravitational fields. It's like playing a game of cosmic pinball. But all this serves as a reminder of the incredible diversity of the universe. Scientists continue to study and learn more about these rare and fascinating systems. And who knows what other mind-boggling star systems are out there waiting to be discovered. Systems of 10, 15 stars. Nearly as many stars as there are in Hollywood. Get it? Stars? Hollywood? Okay, I agree. It's lame. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.